Hello guys, Fabi1 here. Today I'm gonna show you how to upgrade your memory on your laptop. This is a Lenovo Legion Y540 and it only has uh, 8 gigabytes of uh, DDR4 memory. And uh, I'm gonna try to add another stick of memory. But before you go ahead and purchase the new memory you need to install this particular program because you need to know uh, what brand it's very important you need to check out the brand of memory that you have on your laptop yeah you, you need stuff like frequency and the clocks they have to be pretty much the same i think here on spd you can check more details so as you can see this is a ddr4 2666 megahertz and the manufacturer is micron so i didn't find the exact ramaxel retailer but i did find another retailer that has micron technology and all all the clocks and gas latencies and this stuff over here it's the same on the module so this is your first step install cpu z and check your existing uh, memory stick also very important is to to be sure that you have another free slot too so you can add your new memory as you can see slot number two is unpopulated all right so i'm gonna reposition the camera and i'm gonna start uh, unbolting the bolts all right so you should be aware by now that this might void your warranty however i don't really care that much about my warranty so let's begin i'm gonna skip through or fast forward through, through a lot of this but the way you open your laptop it, it will depend on the model and manufacturer Sadly, this one is not magnetic. So I'll loosen them up and pick them with the magnetic screw. Screwdriver. And with this opportunity, I might even clean. the fans if they are dusty, which they might be. Alright, let's get these screws out. Here we go. This one. It should start coming apart. There we go. Another one here. What? You didn't even loosen this one up. <laughs> completely forgot about this one here we go all right i'm gonna try using a knife i don't really recommend it but you might have a piece of plastic around your home use that instead please <laughs> there it is it clicked that's what, what we want to hear. I tried with my fingernails, but it didn't have the, the force to pry it apart. So I think if you do it carefully, you might use the knife. I still do not recommend it. use something like a 
that thing you use for guitar it's a lot safer let's see if, if it comes out now yes progress oh jesus christ all right take extra care in this area all right it's off there's actually not that much to worry about breaking over here set this aside not too much dust but not too much i can do either let's see where might the slots be we go so as you can see this is the populated slot and this is the unpopulated slot where I'm gonna put my memory stick in a few moments because I need to unbox it so this is the memory stick that I got it's from crucial doesn't really matter it's made by micron 2666 megahertz and it has the same characteristics as the memory stick inside so I'm gonna get this one out of it's uh, the cover gently take it out match the notch from the laptop with the match from the memory stick so I'm gonna line this up all right gently press it down I tell you hear the click and there we go we have another stick of memory installer I didn't know where the exact location of the memory sticks were I thought they were under the battery but they are not they are underneath this metal cover That's good because it means it's starting to align. I tell you what, opening this is quite scary, scary. but it's, it's my first time, that's what she said. <laughs> it was the first time, and if I'm ever gonna need to open it again. Now I know, and because of this YouTube video, now you also know. Yeah, it, the the major issue is right here. This this is the the scary part when you had you have that feeling that it's gonna break any moment, but it's not. Uh, 
All right, so now for the moment of truth, let me take you with me on a ride and see if this bad boy starts. That's me, Fabi One, and you're in my tech vault, and we will get some general information so we have 16 gigabytes total and both slots are populated so there you have it this is how you upgrade your memory on a lenovo laptop on another laptops the process might be different but i'm sure there's plenty of youtube videos out there Alright, thanks for watching and see you next time.